unlock that door. Ah, uh, look at that. Oh, he's coming. Hello YouTube, it's Balamore here back again with more Blind Gaming and a new LP for the channel. Hooray! This one's called Lost Secret for the PC of course. I'll leave a spooky link, a very spooky link down below in the description. You can download it and try it out for yourselves. It's a free to play indie horror game. You can't go wrong with that. As a quick disclaimer, I am blind. I've got no center vision at all, only my peripheral. So if I can do this, you most certainly can do it as well. The game page isn't very specific, or I should say very clear on the story. We're going to go into a lost room, or not a lost room, a secret room, and there's going to be a candle burning that eventually will go out and a shadowy man with a mask or something, but uh, we got to escape or die. I think that's pretty much the premise. Before we begin, let's bring in the main host himself. I'm sure he's got something to say about the darkness here in the secret room. Welcome, the devil. Hello, hello, how is everybody doing? Balamore, long time no see, pal. You just saw me last video. Immersion, Balamore, come on, the YouTube algorithm. Oh, 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 sorry. Oh, it's been such a long time. Yes, yes, very long time. So how you been? I'm not too bad. How you been? Not too bad. You just saw me, you idiot. You said immersion. I say a lot of things, Balamore. I'm the king of darkness. I can do what I want, boy. Little meat puppets. Mr. Christian, boy. Yeah, Mr. Christian, goody two-shoes. Yeah, I don't think so. You're going to go to hell. You're a bad boy. That's why I like you. You're a bad boy, and I get to torture you firsthand. Oh, boy, here we go. Oh, here we go. Nothing. Don't look at me like that and roll your eyes. Balmore, stop it. Stop it, Balamore. You got anything to say about the game before we begin? Oh, well, let's see here. Lost secret. You say it was a secret room or something? Yeah, something to do with a secret room and a candle burning out demonic maybe i think there's gonna be a demon oh goody 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 i've been seeing demons a lot lately in these horror games of yours so i've got high hopes <laughs> hope the developer is confident as well because their soul literally depends on it you better die to a demon boy all right i got my popcorn let me uh sprinkle this innocent christian blood on here well what's wrong what do you mean what's wrong i'm putting christian blood on my popcorn that's what i always do no it's usually extra innocent oh wrong vial hold on there's the extra innocent thank you balamore you're looking out for me this extra innocent christian blood is much thicker and sweeter tears of the innocence mixed with it <laughs> got some uh, gummy bears to toss in there that's like diarrhea waiting to happen oh my digestive tract is alpha male balamore i can eat anything i want don't gain a pound i can digest trucks you being a little dramatic with that? No, literally, I could eat a truck and it would digest completely fine. I'd have a nice solid bowel movement. Actually, that probably does make sense with you being the devil. You're not really following human laws when it comes to your digestive system. I don't have one, Balmore. I don't poop. I can eat all I want, though. Okay, moving on. Didn't want to hear it, did you, boy? Well, guys, without further ado, let's just do this. Balmore, you're such a... Oh, God. Just right to it, huh? Oh, I remember playtesting. It's got the jitters. I cleaned them up as much as I could, though. This is the best I could get it to run. The way the game is running is 60 frames, and it seems fine, but they didn't optimize it. I don't know if it's the camera that they put on the player, but, I mean, it's still fine. That's spooky. Uh, that's the candle, huh? Oh, I love the art. Secret room rules are on the table. So he's a shadow man with a mask. That is creepy looking. Hmm. Let's get a good, uh... There we go. There's a good thumbnail right there. Oh, got louder check out the rules all right rules secret room rules the secret room has no exit uh oh don't trust other people that'd be the mask man well unless i find another one 
stay away from the painting room. What was that? Oh, that's our progress. Yeah, that candle's going to burn out. Then you're going to feast on me. So I think this is a puzzly game, and this is inspired out of some sort of a game jam. Ooh. Okay, it closed. I didn't hear it close. It's a keypad in the bottom, isn't it? So right three. Okay, up two, yeah. And then it's, let's see, it could be the third, the second, the second, the second. All right, let's see if I remember that. Oh, it is right there. F to enter password. So it's three, nine, five, seven. Wait a minute. No, I think I typed that wrong. No, 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 that's it. I did get it. I was like, wait, were the circles in a different spot? Or are there other things in this room? Got our key. I like the, the art with that light. It's really cool. Is this the painting room? It is. Oh, there's a desk. We looped. It says locked. Oh, here's another painting. There's a mask man and a candle. So how you guys doing? I hope you're playing something spooky as well. Wait a minute. It's the same code, but it says candle. Oh, wait a minute. I could put the same code in there. You know what? If there's multiple endings, we'll, we'll, we'll do that a second time. So it's going to be three, nine, five, seven. There's a key. Okay. Ugh. Okay, that light's not on. So I think it's just looping. I didn't stay away from the painting room. There was nothing I could do. Can't pick that candle up. Check out the rules. Okay. And it's the same thing. Oh, but that's what you need to initiate. So I wonder if you loop enough, it ends. Same painting in the middle. It is Mass Man and Candle. All right, let's go unlock the door. This is kind of cool, though. I like it. So I know we can probably grab one of those unlit candles and light it with the painting candle, I'm assuming. Since everything's weird and still not lit. Is that lower? It might be. He's creepy. All right, round three. Something's gotta change. Ah, lost forever in a loop. Ending number two. This time we'll we'll see if we can pick up one of those unlit candles. Even though it doesn't seem like you should, but it says candle on this document. Now let's grab this one. Yes. So we can light the candle. Let's check this painting out over here with the candle in case it opens something because it looks like something's there behind the blackness 
All right, so something gonna show up now that we have the candle. So either the code is second through fifth. That doesn't make sense because it's four. So it's gotta be the first and last three. Okay. So it's the one, five, four, seven. And it's a knife. One, five, four, seven. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, that's so cool. All right. Is that going to unlock the painting? Because that looked like a painting key. I can unlock that door. Ah, uh, look at that. Oh, he's coming. I wonder if he's out there still or if he teleported in here. I don't have the knife again. Let's see. It's creepy. I can't tell if he's there. All right, come get me. Ending three death. the second loop I killed him let's grab the key here we're gonna unlock this door okay so he's coming god he's so freaky all right so I have the knife over here still so what if I can kill him now oh yes come come closer We got him. Can I go? Th I can go through. No, I can't. Oh, what is that? Oh. He is not here. And this is still lit. That is different. Okay. He's gonna come at us at some point here. Oh, you can see back there now. That's the beginning room, right? Oh, am I gonna get out of the secret room now? <gasps> yes, this is it. Come get me. Come get some. Let's 
It's the beginning room. Okay. So let's unlock this. I wonder if that painting will work now. So instead of the painting, you had to unlock the door after stabbing him. And then it would initiate this. Okay, I was wondering, I go, ah, I don't have too many more options to do. So I hope you guys are enjoying this. This is actually pretty cool. The key is right there. Oh. All right, we got the knife there. Let's see if we see him. He might be gone, gone. Like, he won't be appearing here. Look at that. Escape. So that was ending one. Okay, guys. So that was Lost Secret for the PC. Don't forget down below in the description, I left a nice convenient link for you guys. You can download and try that out. This was a fun game. So we got all three endings. There could have been a fourth one. So I thought it was a very, very good game. Bravo game developer. That was really cool. I liked it. It was interesting. Even though it ran a little janky, it was still pretty charming in its own right. Well, let's uh, begin with the big review and then get Satan's viewpoint. All right, all right. The part of the LP where Satan himself does the big review. Don't forget game developers and new people on a scale of one to 10. If you get a 4.0 or below, you, your trash game, all the people involved and all of your delicious souls go right to hell for all eternity. Anything above a four, you get to live, temporarily at least, until he deems it worthy to take you. Let's see how you did. Okay, Lost Secret. I give it a review score of... Five out of ten. That's a five out of ten, meat puppet. I thought the viewers were the meat puppets. You're all meat puppets to me, Balamore. You, you're an innocent little Christian meat puppet. Oh, I'm a Christian. I won't go to hell when I die because I'm good. You're going to burn, boy. You got a rude awakening coming. <laughs> I bet I do. Oh, you're admitting it now. Acceptance, right? Isn't that part of depression? No, I'm not accepting anything. Yeah, we'll see, boy. Remember, when you kick it, I'm going to be sitting there squinting at you, shaking my head slow, shaking in disapproval. Then I'm going to take you down there myself. <laughs> Anything else you want to say about the game? No, bravo. It was good. Yeah, the demon guy. I, I like that. You got to kill him a couple times. He came and got you. Made you use your mind a little bit. I was stumped, actually. I didn't know what to do there on that last ending. Actually, ending one. It seemed to be the hardest. Yeah, once you kind of figure it, there was only so much to do, and it was kind of cool to see it all come play. You know, when I heard that cell door knock behind me, and I knew that that room had changed to where it was the entry room instead of that loop, I knew we were golden. Yeah, that was very good, Palemore. Good job there, buddy. Well, thanks guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay as much as I did. Very spooky little game, short and sweet. Multiple endings, it was good. Really, really good. Spooky guy, too. Shadow Man, and he made, with a mask, and he made, uh, I don't know, like a weird sound when he came towards you. It was creepy. Very, very good. So, uh, like, comment, subscribe, share, and or donate, guys. Until next time, as always. Later.